What, what sort of emerging technologies do you see happening in addition to AI in the enterprise tech space here in the next three to five years? In terms of like what clients are looking for and just what you're seeing with our client teams and what kind of boots on the ground with, with companies and what their, where their minds are. Yeah, I still see um, uh, the, the reverse migration of personal commuting coming into the organizations. So all the things that people are doing with their own lives within Amazon and, and the cell phones, the smartphones, and all the applications that come with it tends to drive kind of this concept within organizations. That why can't we apply that here? Um, and in fact, many of the cases, it comes up quite often for those uh, organizations that have large inventory shipping uh, challenges of like, why do I keep pointing to Amazon as being able to tell me it's being picked, it's on a truck, it's in this location, and I know exactly what's going on with it. Why can't we do that as well? Right, and so you see more and more of the user community as their the younger employees coming on to the to the workforce are saying the same things to their organization. Why can't we do what I am able to do in my personal life in the organization? Right, but I also mentioned uh, in an earlier session that uh, I think that the concepts of really advanced technology and companies want to leapfrog from where they are today can be a challenge. Right, the data we just talked about with the AI team. Uh, but just being able to, to block and tackle within an organization needs to be kind of their first band-aid before they really get comfortable with advanced technologies within the footprint. So it's almost like that uh, continued consumerization of enterprise technology where people are expecting their so. enterprise technology to work the way yep. their consumer, like the yep. way they would use an app on their phone. Or exactly.